Okay, hello everyone and welcome back to an update video on the channel. I feel like this is an update video that has been in the making for a while, so I finally got around to kind of sitting down and making it. I finally have a good game to play in the background. This is Star Wars Battlefront 2. I just got it a couple of days ago, actually just yesterday. This is my very first round of Starship Assault, I think that's the mode. And now, you know, without making this uh, video or a discussion about Battlefront 2 in particular, uh, you listen, you know, I know it's a controversial game. I know some people just hate the idea of even giving a penny to EA. I'm sometimes one of those people. However, you know, I've been looking at stuff with this game and now I can genuinely see that the people making it are putting a ton of effort into it. As in, they keep adding free content, new characters, new planets, etc. And you know, that I can respect despite the microtransactions and all the bullshit that went on with this game. So I decided I'd pick it up and you know, play it and it's actually really fun, you know. I'm a huge fan of the old Battlefronts, but you know, the idea of buying this game brand new or buying the Ultimate Edition or some shit, yeah, no way, absolutely no way. So yeah, now that we've gotten suitably sidetracked, let's get back to the original topic which is a channel update. So yeah, this has been coming for a while now. You've probably noticed that pretty much for the last month, yeah, a little bit over a month, uh, my streaming schedule has just not been the same as usual. It has been extremely inconsistent. And that holds true for my upload schedule as well. Honestly, there are several reasons for this. Uh, first things first, August and basically July as well was me on summer holidays like I was enjoying the summer as much as I could uh, you know going to places inviting people over going on holiday you know you tend to enjoy the summer you tend to stay inside a little bit less uh, so that's why the August month especially has been kind of chaotic there were a lot of weeks where I was either off or I was abroad for work or I was at some other events that I couldn't stream however since the end of August it hasn't been like that I have had like basically time at home to stream however the biggest problem is that well the thing is September October especially tend to be the busiest months at my workplace so basically I've been extremely busy and you know the thing about streaming is that you really got to be in the mood for it a lot of the times I'm working throughout the day I get up early you know get back home i am extremely tired not to mention the fact that i still got to do stuff like you know go to the gym sometimes which i'm trying to do more of walk the dog you know spend some time with the fam you know you got to do all of those obligations not well, you know obligations but at the end of the day a lot of the times when i get down to streaming i am like extremely tired and you know the thing about streaming when you're tired it's just not as fun especially it's not as fun for you guys because I'm like yawning I cannot think of a single joke or a single interesting thing to say and lately I've been avoiding that by just streaming when I really feel like it but before with like a remnant I feel like there have been a couple of episodes where it was very noticeable so because of that again the upload schedule or streaming schedule has been kind of thrown out of whack however to compensate for that, I have been trying to make more like actual videos. You know, I still have my Tekken series going, which there will be an episode of tomorrow. MK11 is actually getting a patch, which I am going to cover. Plus, you know, I'm not going to abandon any of the games that I'm streaming. Uh, Blasphemous, especially, I'm having a blast with. Remnant from the Ashes too. So hopefully, hopefully, on Thursday, I can finally get down to streaming as well as on Saturday and you know just kind of work my way back into the streaming schedule. Now I'm gonna say that there won't be interruptions but with the interruptions what I'm going to do is compensate them with videos or at least try to. The other thing is and this has been kind of on my mind for a long time is that right now with YouTube there is just a lot of bullshit going on. I mean I will link it probably in my discord. I wanted to link a video for a long time now uh, Nerd City, one of the best channels currently I think on YouTube. They make like really great like expose videos on YouTube and they especially had one which covered like uh, the fact that every YouTube channel 
has essentially a secret uh, rating system. And if you are rated in the mature category, your videos get heavily, heavily restricted. And honestly, I'm in the mature category. I think on the fact alone that I uploaded Mortal Kombat videos was enough. Plus, you know, I swear, which apparently the bot kind of tends to detect. So when I say fuck, I get put into the mature category. And you know, the problem with this whole rating system is that nobody tells you it's there. Nobody knows how to change it. And once you got a rating, you're stuck with it. And yeah, there's nothing you can do. And I have been really noticing this. Essentially, since the big push that my channel got uh, with Mortal Kombat uh, 11, when it came out way back in April, was it May? April, May, I don't remember. I got like a good 2,500 subs from that. Since then, my channel growth has essentially been dead. Dead in the water. Like, the first few MK videos were getting great views, the tutorials, and then it just started dropping and dropping because the algorithm realized that MK was kind of a bad game, quote-unquote. And now, if I upload MK, it just barely gets any views. As do my other videos, which, you know, I will say, nobody is entitled to views. Nobody is entitled to have, uh, like a semi-successful YouTube channel, which I feel like I have or had. Uh, yeah, nobody's entitled to that. And I'm not saying this from a point of someone who says I should be entitled to views. It's just, you know, really disheartening when I think I put effort into certain videos and they struggle to break 100 views, which is not on any of the viewers, you know, it's not on you guys. It's basically, I think, on YouTube, just pushing my videos to zero people. I'm barely even certain that uh, like half my subs are getting notifications on my videos. And you know, that's, you know, part of it is natural. A channel that's been around for a while like mine tends to experience this, that a lot of people who used to watch kind of tend to drift away. The idea is that you would replace these with new people. However, since YouTube doesn't push my videos because I'm rated mature, I basically have no way of getting new viewers. And that's something I've really been noticing, like the incredible lack of new viewers. Uh, not that I, you know, I don't like the OG crowd who show up to all the streams and all that, but it would be nice, you know, sometimes to get like new faces around here as well. And, you know, that's the struggle. That's the struggle with this current environment of YouTube that essentially there is no incentive to produce any sort of serious content or mature content because it's immediately going to get restricted. Rant over, you know, this is, I'm not going to make this like a YouTube rant again. I fully understand that nobody is entitled to any kind of success on YouTube. It's just, again, the disheartenment that comes from uh, seeing a video you think turned out good, uh, again, struggle to get like 100 views, it's just kind of there. There's no way to, you know, not feel disheartened. I think it's pretty much impossible. Anyways, I didn't want to make this like into a feel bad for me video. It's not even about that. Just I'm saying that I am trying to like put effort into the videos and put them out and I'll just keep making them. But, you know, sometimes there will be gaps. I will take sometimes a day or two off just because of the schedule and things, but I am especially working on getting back into a consistent streaming schedule. In terms of that, um, that's gonna be about it. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here. This Starfighter Assault gameplay has been terrible, I know. Literally my first round, so uh, yeah. I've played the OG Battlefront, but I have that on PC and this is on PS4, so gotta get back into the flight controls. And now I'm yawning again, which is exactly what I want to avoid on stream. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this little update slash, I guess, YouTube rant video. I'll see all of you next time. Peace out, guys. Goodbye.